what we do here is go back, 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 back. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Taylor Made Otaku. Today, we return to Attack on Titan Season 2. My apologies. my From the bottom of my heart, I do apologize for not having an episode up last week. There was a lot of user error on my part. There was a lot of technical errors on my computer's part. And there were some scheduling conflicts with my job and us being there way longer than we were supposed to. But, we're here, we're live, it is me with the man, the myth, the legend, my little brother, Sheriff from Shooting Star Sheriff, say what's good to the squad, cuz. Yo, what's good everybody out there in Taylor Meadow Taco? Did you just pull on me? I just pulled on you, dog. How does that make you feel? I'm so proud. (laughs) (laughs) For those of you out there who don't know what we're talking about, usually when we're recording these things, what he normally does is he'll just, we'll have some random conversation about, I don't know, maybe like uh, our favorite like manga that we're reading or his favorite game or the birds and the bees or something, something random like that. And then all of a sudden he'll just jump into his intro and I'm just sitting there just dumbfounded like, Okay, I can't say nothing because I can't interrupt his intro. So I just did that to him. So, yeah. You know how, like, you have you ever seen The Dark Knight Rises? I have not seen The Dark Knight Rises. There's a scene where, like, you know how Batman always disappears on people? And they're yeah. like, what the fuck? They're literally like, what the fuck? Yeah. And then there's literally a scene in The Dark Knight Rises where someone does that to Batman. And Batman's looking there all dumbfounded. He's like, that's what that feels like. <laughs> How I felt. That's literally how I just felt when you did that to me. <laughs> but anyway, continue. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to my world, cuz. But we're gonna be reviewing episodes ten and eleven in this in this here episode. Ten, I'm gonna go through that one pretty quick, and then we're gonna dive into this episode number 11. We have one more to go. The season is literally almost up. But without further ado, let's jump right into this with episode number 10. And episode number 10 was pretty much, you could say, your mirror's background along with a little bit of... Uh, per- yeah, yeah, it's pretty much your mirror's background. The episode can pretty much be summed up as your mirror... Uh, convinces Rainer and Bertholdt to bring along Krista as a kind of like a package deal. You like you either get like me and Krista, or you don't get me. Like I'm not going with you without Krista, since she's so important to this plan. Then it pans back to Ymir's childhood, where she was picked as by a cult to be a, I guess a like a uh, a queen f- for them. And she was a queen for about 10 years. And then they were caught by the royal guard or like the knights or the police or whoever. And here's where things get interesting in that episode. They are thrown off a wall, but once they go off the wall, that they are transformed into titans. They turn into titans. So it makes me think that there's like a serum that's being like injected into these people that turns them into titans. And then she roams roams the world for about 60 years. And then she pops up out of the ground and she starts me and she meets everybody and that's how that happened. And then the the scouts finally show up, they find her, and she takes Krista, and then she gets on the back of the armor titan, and then they start hauling ass in a direction, and then here come the scouts on their little horses chasing after them. That's episode ten in a nutshell. Now, let's move on to episode eleven, where the pursuit is real. They are chasing and chasing and chasing, and I can't remember what the leader's name. What's the leader of them? Like the dude with like the yellow hair and like the side. You know, you know what I mean? The sideburns. Oh, um, 
Oh, I can't I can't remember his name. I was about to say Hans, and I was like, Hans is not the leader. But <laughs> you Hans said yellow. ain't the leader at all. He ain't no leader. Oh, um, he's there. Hans is there. Hans Homie is there. Hans. <laughs> Homie Hans. But I can't remember his name. His name escapes me right now. Like I can't remember his name either, but he was leading. He's like, this is for mankind. Mankind does not have a future without Aaron. We have to get him. And, by the way, he's saying all of this after he got he got snatched up by a titan. So, yeah, that was that was fun. And so they run to go get him and <laughs> they they swarm and they get all around his neck about to chop his neck. But Rainer puts his arms around his neck to protect his neck and to protect Bert Holt and uh, who has Aaron with him. And just so y'all know, <laughs> this entire episode, Mikasa was not playing <laughs> no games dog you right over there yeah i'm good i'm good sorry no, no, no it's all right it's all right but yeah mikasa was not playing any games this entire episode like she was hell-bent on saving Aaron, and nobody was gonna get in her way she was gonna body anybody in her way she was she was like psyching herself up like i'm not gonna hesitate like i did last time because last time i hesitated and they grabbed Aaron and they took him. Now I I cannot afford to hesitate. And but before all that, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm all over the I'm all over the place, baby. But Ymir actually kind of no, she didn't actually kind of. She actually she 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 like spit up Krista and was telling Krista, and she kept correcting herself and calling Krista Historia. Which made me very angry because I hate that name a lot. No, yeah, <laughs> yeah, nobody likes that. I, I don't, I don't like that name at all. And then <laughs> Ymir was trying to like get Crystal, like, "Hey, come with us, and everything will be fine." If they, they were threatening me, they said if I don't bring you along, that they were gonna kill me. You know, to, to get Krista, to, you know, to like agree to go, but Krista was like, "We don't need to go. You need to turn around. You need to grab Aaron, and we need, we all need to go home. No matter what happens, though, I'm always going to be on your side." And now, and I know why you like her so much. That girl's sweet. That girl, that's a good girl right there. She is. It's a good girl. That's Bay right there. I understand. I understand. And then. Because of that, Mikasu was like, look, I'm chopping down everything in my way. Are you going to be a problem? And Chris is like, I, I, I don't want that problem, but I can't really back down right now. So, I guess not. <laughs> and you may weren't going to have none of this, but Chris stopped her from you know, attacking Mikasa, and Mikasa gave Bert Holt, like, the look of death. Like, when I get in there, you gonna die. And, which was actually pretty awesome. I love her so much. She is my baby. Like Tom and Jerry, and when he was singing that, that song, Is You Is or Is You Ain't My Baby. You Ain't baby. My Baby. Boy, boy, Mikasa is my baby. The way she acting lately really gets me down. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you know that word from word. Dog. That's my song. That was like my favorite episode of Tom. That's my favorite thing Tom and Jerry have ever done. Just that that song. It was like, I don't know, like the third time he ever opened up his, op- up his mouth and words came out. So it was it was yeah, cool. That's, yeah, that's true. But I'm all over the place. I was talking about Attack on Titan. I was talking about Tom and Jerry. Let's go. Let's jump back to Attack on Titan. In it. After that, that's when things got real serious. Because Reiner was running directly into a swarm of Titans. So everybody dispersed off of Eren. Let me rewind and twist that back to what it was supposed to be. Everybody jumped off Reiner. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and 
and they all jumped off. They went back to their horses. I, but before that, I thought Armin was about to have his little moment. I thought he was actually going to save Aaron, but he didn't. He just stood there petrified and then just started, uh, hey, oh, you remember, you remember Annie? She's getting tortured. Are you going to leave her behind? And then, then that's when, uh, that's when Mikasa swooped right on in and she snatched up Aaron, which was pretty neat. And I think, and I thought to myself, oh. Well, they got his ass. So, that was cool. (laughs) Mikasa came in and said, Gotcha, bitch! So then they get on the horse and they start booking it. This entire time, you know, Rainer is surrounded by Titans. And so he just decides to pick him up and just start chucking him. Yep. At that point... I I got I got super high when he just started chucking Titans. I don't know why, because they were going they were going a ways because they were going a ways. Yeah, I mean he was literally throwing them like like they wasn't nothing. I don't know where he got all that strength with no other. With, it was it, that was pure arm strength. He didn't even step into the throw. He didn't position his body in a way to throw. He it. just he just, he just chucking them like this. Chucked it. And they just started landing, and then everybody, everybody started falling off horses. Mikasa and uh, Aaron were on the same horse, and they fell off the horse. And Doc, I need for you to tell the. the I, I want you to do this. I want you to tell them exactly what happened right after they fell off that horse. So they fell off that horse, and so there's a lot of dust and stuff, right? There's a lot of dust, and it's like coming. It's coming up. And the dust is coming up. And Mika's is like, what's going on? What's going on? And then there's this tall, shadowy figure. <laughs> this tall, shadowy figure oh, that looks and resembles a titan. And the smoke settles in Aaron's face. Like, like you, you know that old face you make when you orgasm? <laughs> it's, it's worse than that. And we and the screen pans up, <laughs> and it is the Titan that started it all. It is the Titan that ate Aaron's mama. The Titan responsible for every single ounce of his anger. <laughs> a good eighty. I give. I mean, I give a good fifty percent to to that Titan. The other fifty percent comes from the colossal and the and the armored Titan. <laughs> good chunk though it's a good chunk it's it's a marvelous chunk and that's how episode 11 ends on that cliffhanger so just a prediction on my part i haven't read the manga this guy has i keep forgetting that and i've asked him every single time what he thinks (laughs) is gonna happen next he brought this to my attention off screen so i'm not gonna ask him jack (laughs) about what he thinks is gonna happen next episode (laughs) Okay. I'm just going to tell you what I think is going to happen. I think Aaron's going to lose his freaking mind and just start biting random orifices on his body, transform into a titan, and specifically attack that one. And everyone's trying to tell him, bro, we got this. We need to leave right now. And I can also see Mikasa helping him kill this stupid titan. But I, but I think that titan would be a titan shifter and it turns out to be like, oh, oh, I don't know. Prob- I don't know. I don't know what that Titan looks like. It kind of looks like Levi, but it ain't Levi. Also, fangirls, how y'all feel that Levi has been in all of, like, two minutes of this entire season? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Shots fired. <laughs> like, I mean, I mean, it's the truth. He's been in... Uh, okay, I'll change. I'll switch it up. He's been in th- in, t- in three minutes total in this entire season. But I digress. That's what I think's gonna happen. What do you guys think was gonna happen? Cause what was your favorite part of this episode? I can ask you that because that's not Spoiler City. <laughs> I mean, it's not like I gave spoilers and before it anyway. Like, I know. Um, I'm proud fa- of you. I know. Um. So my favorite part of this episode. Um, actually, it wasn't the whole, um, so my favorite part of the episode was pretty much, um, 
Oh, oh, dang. Um, the whole part between Kristen and Yamir when she was like, "We're, fr- you know, we're friends. Like we're we like we're best friends. We're gonna stick together, you know, to the end. Like, you know, you don't have to drag me anywhere. I'm gonna, you know, I'll go wherever you go because you're my friend. You know what I mean? It, it was it, that was really cool, and I I really love seeing like th- this relationship just really being solidified, um, just between these two characters because they've been through so much together. So it's it's really it's 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 really nice and reassuring that like even though you know Yamir Yamir's character Yamir's character is literally all about protecting Krista, but you know and, and Krista's kind of wanted to be like a stronger person so she doesn't have to rely on Yamir all the time. So it, it's kind of nice to kind of see you know them, you know them these you know her like uh, Krista acknowledge. Um, you know, everything that Ymir has done for her and, you know, like, yeah, you know, I'm, you know, no matter what, you know, we ride together, you know, we ride together, die together. So I thought, I thought that was a cool moment. That was a cool moment in the episode. That was dope, dog. That was dope. My favorite moment in this episode was probably the, like, the moment, like, they got Aaron and they saved him because I was thinking to myself, dude, this is, this is really dragging on. And then they finally got him. I was like, well, mission accomplished. But ever since they got him, like, the hype for the episode, like, went up, like, from that moment to, like, the end of the episode, which is what you so, uh, how you so eloquently put it, put it, was awesome. You got a least favorite part of this episode? <clears throat> really don't. I, I honestly, I, I'm going to be 100, 100. I'm going to be 100 percent transparent. We know the last few episodes was nothing but exposition, and they were probably really boring to sit through. They so this episode was really good. I mean, compared to compared to the rest of the season, this episode was really good. Probably, aside from whatever cliffhanger they're going to leave us off on next week, this is probably one of the better episodes this season. True. True. So you have nothing to say. I really don't. I didn't like that part. I really I, don't have a bad part because, like, everything is kind of all the all the things that we have basically all the questions that we had in season one have kind of been answered. Season two, like season one, we were like, "Who's the Armor Titan? Who's the Colossal Titan?" Those literally got answered like episode four. <laughs> and then now, now the whole thing is. Okay, who's who's behind, who's who's pulling the strings? So now, now it's like now that we know that Bert Holt and Rainer are only the tip of the iceberg. How many other Titan shifters are out there, and how many people? How many other Titan shifters are working with Rainer and Bart Holt and, and Annie or whatever? Like, who are they working for? So I think it's kind of like getting into the whole mystery of like. Who are we actually fighting against? Are we really fighting against Titans? Or are we fighting against Titan Shifter? Like, you know what I mean? I think that's where... I think that's what the path we're going down now. True. Doug. That's a very good point that you brought up because I completely forgot to mention it. They were... Once they... When they were all around their his neck, they were... They were, you know, saying, you know, guilt tripping. Like, pretty much, like, we had all this fun together. We had all this stuff together. We fought Titans together. We pretty much grew up as a team together. And you mean to tell me all that meant nothing? And then Berthold's like, you really think that we that we want to kill people? You think we want to do this? We don't have a choice. And that kind of, you know, raises the questions that you that you've been asking. Like, okay, if you didn't have a choice, who's telling you you don't have a choice? Who's pulling the strings? Why are you doing this? What is the what is your goal in life? Because the human's goal is to get rid of you. <laughs> so what's yeah. your what's your overall goal? Yeah. And and earlier this and earlier in the season when they revealed their identities, they said that we have been ordered to to, to wipe out humanity. The key words, we have been ordered. Yeah. Yeah. So they're not doing so. They literally are soldiers. So if they're soldiers, then there's a lieutenant, and there's a there's a lieutenant or a captain. There's someone pulling the there's someone pulling the strings. 
They're 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 the pawns. It's all it's all getting so interesting. Yeah. I still ain't gonna read that manga, but it's getting interesting. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. But that's all we got for you guys. This time this video is getting a little bit long. Just it's the tad though. But if you like this video, leave a like. If you wanna discuss this episode or the season in general, put that down in the comment section below. If you have a prediction that you don't know the answer to, please <laughs> do not spoil me. Oh god. Put that in the comment section down below. It's It'd be really, really neat to hear what you guys think about this. Next week is the finale, so this next week will be the last episode that we do this on Attack on Titan. Uh, after that, we're going to pick up again with another show. If you guys want to recommend a show for us to pick up and review together next next season, please don't hesitate. Put that in the comment section down below. Do me a huge solid and go subscribe to my boy Shooting Star Sheriff over here. He's over there. He just hit 100 subscribers. So, congratulations to him. That was his goal. Now, he's on the road to a million. Well, actually, 200. <laughs> a million's a little much for, much right now. So, do me a solid. Go subscribe. Support support my boy over here. If you like me, you like what I do, uh, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button. If you've already subscribed, thank you for subscribing. Thank you. I love you too. Well, until next until next week guys for the finale of this series. Peace out. Peace guys.